Time for another episode of Flashback. Flashback. Tracks from the past. Today, I'm a little bit too tired to do all of this uh, cool storytelling and stuff. But we got lots of new music and I'm going to talk a little bit about the tunes. Reading from the instrument list, which is fun and sometimes insane. <laughs> Saying true devotion to. So let's go to Mod Archive and check the comments for this one. The instrument list does not contain, well, anything else than instruments. So the comments. 
in 2020, Janko Weber wrote a comment. He rated the tune 7 out of 10. He think, well, sorry for the grammar here, but I think this is a too much experimental product file. I made a very simple cut down club trance rearrangement. I'm gonna give you a link in the description later. You can listen to that if you want to. ADKD, he wrote in uh, 2020 in February, rating the song 9 out of 10. Very nice. This tune is by Alpa of Insane. It's beautiful and simple and completely old school. Men of Brainstorm, Devotion Shuttle, and that was a classic Fast Tracker module. Not much to say there. In the instrument list, he notes it's a ship tune plus plus tune for Birdie, whoever that is. Well, nice.
Dr. Jacko, General Chaos. That's some impulse tracker goodness right there. And the comments? Dash PC writes in December 2019 while giving the song a 9 out of 10. Another cool song to be featured for an everlasting period of time. Sirius, also in December 2019, and rating the song 10 out of 10, he writes, This is a bestiality. Uh, what? An awesome job. Now, if you create something and the comment says it's bestiality and likes it, that is... I, I don't know. Was that an insult or was it a compliment? I cannot say. <laughs> So, and the song is called Randolph Fox Elk. The instrument list reads like written by a madman. Here it is. What would you say to a Toyota 87? I thought so too. A sow of tractor come to grab. If we manage to scrounge up a hole to keep it in, well, if not, you're still welcome. I'm a lumberjack, and don't you come back no more, no more, no more. Is he selling or receiving the car? I don't really get this one. Also, what has Monty Python and Hit the Road Jack to do with anything?
Ah, yes, that's a classic four-track Amiga module. It's signed by Filippetto of Cenit, called Stormy and Clever. He sends his thanks to Tip, MTX, Nuke, Moby, me, himself, hmm? and other unknown guys. This song is called Stormy and Clever, simply because it's Stormy and Clever. Well, that was not very clever, right? Reason by Firelight, and I'm happy to declare it's another Amiga four track module. Most uh, tunes coming in right now they are either fast tracker or impulse tracker, but it's good to see the Amiga on the block again, so to speak. And uh, the instrument list well, he greets Ryan of Griff for taking some of these excellent samples. Yes, they are great. It says Gus Patches, and Gus is Gravis Ultrasound, if you didn't know. And he think that you are one of the best out there. Signed Firelight in 1994. <laughs>
Mechanical Energy by Galgox. It was written in 2019 for a demo party and got second out of fifth place. That is what Galgox writes in the instrument list. And he says, oh, and use no interpolation. Well, I'm sorry, too late. Galgox gets another chance here on the station. It's Ferry Crusaders 3. A wild ship entry for Winter Ship 15 at uh, the Battle of the Bits Lyceum competition, or what you should call it. A traditional annual battle held every year for noobs all over the world. To take a part in. No interpolation, by the way. Yeah, 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 you you said that, and I still... (laughs) Sorry, my, my script does that.
J. Cool and a twinkle. We're back to Impulse Tracker modules. This one, it was composed by J. Cool, as I said, and it was done for Assembly 99. Yes, actually. A bit of a story here. Uh, you were maybe asking why I was talking about interpolation. That's simply a thing that modern systems do, which means when you overlap sounds from different channels, you don't get that nasty click that can happen with Amiga modules, because the Pola, the Amiga chip, didn't support this. And you can turn it on in a conversion program, such as I'm doing, and he didn't want me to do it. I did it anyway, because I don't like how this sounds when you kind of push the volume up. So, well, that's the explanation, I guess. <laughs> I'm a bit of a fan of old comics, so it brings me a big smile on my face that the song is called Hobbs Adventure. It's by KO0X, and he writes in the instrument list, Hey, made a song for ship tunes, win volume 4, and it ended up on the compilation, and then a heart. 
tracked with open mod plug tracker mastered by DJ Cutman, not the module, of course. Okay, great. IPI and deinterlacing. It's done on Impulse Tracker and was released on the 5th of May 2020. And it was released for Spring Tracks 9 in the 64K S3X Modit category. He also makes a bit of a plug, but hey, we can join that. He created it live on the stream for Twitch TV slash IPI Dev. Thanks to all that came to listen and help. Hmm, seems I still have some room for more messages. Shame, I don't have anything else to say. <laughs> yeah, I know that pain.
to Fast Tracker. That was Mistra with Shop Sui. And in the instrument list, he writes, finished in June 27 as a contribution to the big Ship Compo 8. Samples by Radix or Saror, I think. The name of Mistra is obviously Shell Pedersen. <laughs> Beautiful tune, K. Jose, Spanish artist with the song Enemy Forces Version 2. And he writes the following in the instrument list. An orchestral remake of my previous track, Enemy Forces, transposed to G. Contains high quality samples, some of which are stereo. Position 18 contains Quad Surround version, best heard in OpenMPT with quad speakers. I don't have that. Or with virtual surround turned on. Okay. And uh, position 36 contains an arrangement of the same song design designed around Super Nintendo Entertainment System sound hardware specifications. Ho. Oh. Also attempted to simulate Super Nintendo Echo Reverb. Cool. <laughs> Thank you. 
Sirius and Radiomorphosis. It was released in 2020 and created in OpenMPT. He writes, This time I focused more on the sound and looked for an experimentation, moving from something dark to something brighter, and bright it is indeed.
that was Mellow D with Pilot. And I'm sorry, I cannot read the instrument list here. It is not sane for human consumption. Makes a lot of references to nasty stuff and seems to be totally unhinged. Well, that was fun. We're going on with the last tune for today. Thanks for listening. This is DJ Demon here checking out. Well, not mentally, but at least I will go home now. Next week, a new episode. And we are ending with Malmen and Tomorrow Land. The Eric Hage Radio Network, with all the best music, composed on Pro Tracker, Noise Tracker, Impulse Tracker, and Fast Tracker.